I was gonna start this video off by surprising you, but I'm, I just realized what the title is gonna be. So yeah, uh, pulled my shoulder, dislocated it, whatever you wanna call it. Ow. <sighs> you hear the cracks, bro? It's kinda crazy. I can move it. There's a little bit of pain right now. Maybe a two, but yeah, I can move it. And the crazy thing is, this is not the first time it's happened. This is actually the fourth time I've pulled this freaking shoulder. Before I tell you what happened, I'm gonna tell you like, backstory, okay? So the very first time I pulled the shoulder, and it's always the right one too, I'm always, pull I'm always pulling the right shoulder. First of all, the reason why I pulled it, I think I, think I have double jointed shoulders. Hold up, I don't know if you can see it, but they pop, I can pop them out of place. So I'm already at risk, okay? Ow, what the frick? So the first time, I was playing basketball against a freaking sixth grader. I was um I was like 15, so I was ninth grade. A little freaking sixth grader. And he put the ball in front of my face. And instead of like, I'll use this hand. <laughs> instead of like reaching in to grab it, like just grab grabbing it, my dumb ass decided to just hit it out of his hand. And I hit it out of his hand, but I pulled my shoulder in the process. So it's, um, yeah. That was the first time. The second time was the same exact day. So. I had went to a party at a trampoline place and there was this American Ninja Warrior thing and my shoulder actually felt like a little better than it does right now actually so I thought I was okay and I decided to do the wall I did this American Ninja Warrior course and I decided to do the last thing which was you know the wall run when you put your arm up and hang on the wall and pull yourself up uh yeah I, I used my bad arm for some reason like it just my brain went <laughs> And I used my bad arm to grab the wall to pull myself up. And I pulled it again, and I was like, ah, ah, ah ow, frick. <laughs> Why does it keep doing that? And the third time happened a year after I pulled it initially. So I pulled it October, in October. October 2019 was the first time it happened. The same day, two times in one day. Next time was October of 2020. So about a year later, I was doing... I was working as a tree trimmer and I picked up some logs, I put it over the shoulder and they were just like, run, run, run. Cause that's what you do, you run when something's heavy, you got it on your shoulder and you just run and boom, 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 you pull it. That's what we did at the job. We pulled trees and logs and shredded them up. So I picked it up, I'm like, boom. And I go to run, my shoulder stays back. <laughs> it just went zook. And I was like, zook, and I was like, ah. But it popped right back into place, so I was good. I was good. So that brings us to today. And this was probably the worst that it's pulled. It's, it was definitely the most painful and it stayed out for quite a while. Very embarrassing, kind of like the first story. We was out playing football, doing drills, you know, making plays because I deserve to be in the NFL. And I have, I'm like, I'm so good. And I don't have any proof, but like, I'm so good. Like they could recruit me now and I could be like MVP in the Super Bowl and stuff. But yeah, I was doing that and I was throwing stuff around. I didn't stretch, first of all. Uh, I stretched my legs, didn't even stretch my arm. So I'm just throwing it, throwing it, throwing it, throwing it. And the wind's coming my way, so I have to throw it harder, right? I, I have to throw it harder in order to get it to my dad. I was playing with my dad and my stepdad. Uh, my dad kicked it and went, woo. So I go get it, woo, 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 pick it up. He's like, like 50 yards away and the wind's blowing in my face. I'm like, oh, okay. Let's go. This is gonna be a heavy throw, like a really hard throw. I'm gonna give it everything I got. And in my mind, I was like, 90% of me was like, I'm not gonna be able to get it to him. It's too far, I'm not gonna be able to make it to him. And then 10% was like, I can do this. I got this, I got this. So boom, I go to throw the ball. So like, I throw it and it just, and the ball went like, halfway towards him it hit the ground so it wasn't even cool it wasn't even worth it so boom i just threw it ah shoulder came out of socket so i was just like ah i fell to the ground <laughs> i was just like ah. it really hurt i was on the ground i was just closing my eyes i'm like oh man ah i think my dad and my stepdad were just like i think they just thought i just fell and just wanted to rest and so my dad threw the ball at me <laughs> it almost hit my head and hit the ground next to me and, and bounced over me I was just still on the ground like this, with my shoulder out like, ah, ah. I couldn't move it, dude. I really couldn't move it. It was just like this. It was just sticking out. I think I have a picture. I can show you a picture. It looked kind of like that. Yeah. So it was just sticking out. And 
I was on the ground. So my dad came over and he was like, uh, I gotta pull it. I was like, okay, just pull it, just pull it, pull it. So I'm like biting my finger I'm like this, my tank top, I'm biting it. He pulls it once, phew, nothing happens. Um, surprisingly, maybe I was in shock. It wasn't painful when he was pulling it, so it was good. Like I was in pain the whole time, but it didn't add any extra pain. So I pulled it once, phew, it's still out of place. Uh, you pull it again, phew, still out of place. I'm like, man. So this is this went on for a good like maybe like only three minutes, but it felt like ten minutes, bro. He helped me up and I and I stood up. <laughs> this is kind of funny. This, this is really funny actually. I stood up and as soon as I stood up, my shoulder went zook and just went right back into place, bro. It looked like magic. It went right back into place. Whoosh, and I was like, oh. And I laughed, bro. That genuinely my reaction was just like, oh. That's what I said, bro. Because the pain just instantly went away, bro. It was it was pretty freaking crazy. After that, like an hour or two after it happened, there was like no pain. And now I'm feeling some pain. So I'm kind of worried how I'm going to wake up tomorrow. Um, but hopefully the pain just goes away. Because, ow, maybe it won't. The first time I pulled it two times in one day, that pain lasted for like a month. The second time I pulled it, it lasted maybe that day and the next day and then it was fine so i'm hoping this will be like the second time i pulled it or the third time i pulled it second occasion i pulled it yeah so i'm hoping i'll be good i won't be able to uh, throw a football for i looked it up about six weeks so i'm probably won't be able to lift anything which kind of sucks but best believe i'm going to be doing plenty of squats a lot a lot of squats i'm going to be getting my legs right Okay, my legs are going to be in tip top shape. And then I'm going to do like some basic core exercises because if y'all remember my exercise videos, every single ab machine, bro, it, it requires you to have a grip and use your arms in some type of way. So like that seat that I'd be doing, the captain's chair, I think what it's called, I forgot what it's called. You literally got to pull that bar down like this. You need to, you need to have some strength to pull it down. It's not just your abs, you got to have boom. And if you remember, I hurt my shoulder a couple times doing that machine. Same with the Shakira machine, man. This, the little rotations, you got to have a grip on it to rotate your body. So you need to have some type of shoulder in that exercise. There's this other machine. I think I've done it on camera maybe once or twice. It's literally like you sit down, grab the bar, and you just go forward like this. It's the ab machine. And that puts a lot of strain on your shoulders. So I definitely cannot do that one for a while. The only machine that I could probably use is like the leg lifts. Where I'm just sit up like this and my legs lift up. Even that, even doing that might hurt my shoulder. Because I'm just... So, don't even know if I could do that. But I'm going to be doing ground exercises. I'm going to be laying on my back, lifting up my legs. Just that. Uh, bicycle crunches. Basic crunches. Just that type of stuff. And a lot of cardio. A lot of cardio. And now it's, it's making me debate if I want to do carnivore again. Hopefully I can heal pretty quickly before I do carnivore. Because once I do carnivore, I'm not going to stop for a while because I'll feel horrible. So, ah. But yeah, crazy day, crazy story time. But that'll do it, y'all. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for simply clicking on the video. If you watched all the way through, I appreciate that. Thank you. I love y'all and I appreciate y'all so, 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 so much. And I hope you had an amazing day today. I hope you smiled today. And if not, I hope you made someone else's day a little brighter. But that'll do it, y'all. I will catch y'all in the next video. God bless. Peace. Hoot. Woo!